In 1928, Frederick Griffin showed that the Streptococcus pneumoniae's R strand is transformed into the live S strand. But what really transformed was not clear. In 1944, the first experimental evidence that the genetic material of the living cells is composed of DNA was established by Oswald Avery, Colin McLeod, McLean McCarthy. The genetic material was thought to be a protein or an RNA or a DNA molecule. To confirm which one of these is the actual genetic material, the following experiment was conducted. They added enzymes that would degrade each one of the following in separate vials and check for transforming activity. Addition of protease degraded the protein and addition of RNAs or ribonuclease degraded the RNA both of which showed no effect on the transforming activity addition of DNAs or deoxyribonuclease caused the DNA to degrade and thus the transforming activity was also hindered this showed that the genetic material was not protein or RNA but actually DNA